Hello my fellow degenerates, Cookboss88 here and welcome to Love, Mary Kill, Furry Edition. Now, a few weeks ago I asked you guys to send me your furry crushes and now I'll be judging them on whether or not I should love, Mary kill them. <laughs> This idea was brought to light by Bucks Next Studio. If you haven't checked out his own Love Mary Kill video, go check it out in his channel. Uh, link in the description. And without further ado, let's go judge some furries. Ah, yes, Melon. For our first pick, um, his tattoos look stunning. I don't like him though. <laughs> Not as a friend or as a potential lover. I vote kill. D due to sociopath, I am the kind of person who is not attracted to these kinds of people. But if that's your thing, good luck to you. But it's not for me. I vote kill. Okay, Wolf O'Donnell. I don't like him. Sorry, Dust. He's kind of arrogant and acts like an ass, and I don't like that. To me, nothing shrivels up my dick more than a pompous, arrogant ass. It's a kill for me, dog. Okay, Bowser is an instant Mary for me, and it's not because he canonically has a muscle gut, okay? But the muscle gut definitely helped with my decision. <laughs> Bowser has been the bad guy for far too long, and when you get past the princess kidnappy aspect of his personality, you are left with a single dad that's just, you know, trying to run a kingdom, and I like that. Hey, it's Haida, the world's most lovable simp. I like him, but not enough to marry him though. Maybe I'll love him as a friend? I don't know, I'll love him. <laughs> But as a friend, I've just pretty much just friends with everyone's favorite simp. I don't really care. <laughs> okay, Nefaru is an easy decision for me. I'll go with love, cause for anyone who's ever read the VN, we can all agree that Nefaru is just too promiscuous for a long-lasting relationship such as marriage. But we know that he's probably amazing in bed, so I'll go with love. Okay, Shiro Ogami is a complicated character. I like him, but he hasn't exactly shown any husband-worthy traits yet, so I'd say love. He's got a lot of things about himself that he needs to figure out, and a lifelong commitment such as marriage is just gonna, you know, get in the way of that. Ah, this dude, Duke Doberman. I am almost too afraid to answer this one. I'm particularly not attracted to him, um, considering I don't know him at all. He's an actual person underneath that fursuit. I've never hung out with him, I've never talked to him, so there's no connection at all. And considering what he's into just by looking at a glance at his Twitter, um, it's not really something that I enjoy particularly, so um, it's gonna it's gonna be a kill for me. Hey, Legoshi! I'd have to go with love with this one. He's a good guy, he's polite, he's shy and gentle. But I don't like him enough to marry him. Haru can rest easy knowing that a bear from YouTube isn't gonna take away her man. <laughs> okay, this one is a kill. I'm sorry, I like Louie as a character, but as a love interest, there is actually nothing for me to hold on to. I'd say kill him and let Juno have what's left. You know, that sounded less darker in my head. And again, just like Louie, Michiru has nothing for me to hold on to in the romance department. So I vote kill for Michiru. Oh, that 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 is an instant marry for me, hands down. Cause it's Sibon son. She's cute, she's petite, she technically qualifies as a MILF. So marry it is. Also, she's kind of a bit of a lonely person and I kinda think she needs someone in her life to, you know, spice things up a bit. Ah yes, everyone's favorite Yakuza Lion. Out of all the members of the Shishigumi, Agata has the biggest chance of redemption. I'd marry him. Oh, the zoologist from Terraria. Nah, it's a kill for me. I don't play Terraria. And, you know, she's just an NPC. And as I said that, Colin Bryan from the Heavenly Hangout Discord is plotting to kill me. He's got a huge soft spot for this character. <laughs> so, um, 
Colin, if you ever um if you ever get to watching this video, please um can you wait until I'm 25 for you to kill me? Okay, you know what? I'll marry Guhin. I like Guhin. He's like the OG bear daddy. Buff muscles all rippling while he moves. Hell yeah, I want that in my life. Oh, Majira Strawberry, how did you get it here? <laughs> I don't know him that well though, so um I mean he's cute, but not feeling anything besides that, so I vote kill. This dude, Mordecai from Lackadaisy. Nah, too murder killery for me. I'd rather kill him. He's dapper in his clothing, but there is not enough clothing in this world to cover up the blood that's staining his paws. Oh, come on. Come on. This is the easiest decision hands down all throughout the video. Y'all know how much I adore Amicus, right? Not only is this wolf the epitome of furry husbandry, but he also has a friggin' muscle gut. I don't care how well you look in a fitted suit, if you don't have a belly for me to hold on to when I hug you, that suit ain't, okay? That's why I vote for Mary. And that brings us to the end of Love, Mary Kill, Furry Edition. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, all that jazz. Follow me on Twitter, chat with me on Discord, and support me on Coffee. Donate a dollar, donate a hundred, all up to you. This has been your fellow degenerate, CookBoss88, and I'll be seeing you in the next video. See ya! Sometimes I hit every single stupid word you say. Sometimes I want to slap you in your whole face. There's no one quite like you. You push all my buttons down. I know life would suck without you. At the same time, I want to hug you. I want to wrap my hands around your neck. You're an asshole, but I love you. And you make me so mad, I ask myself why I'm still here. Or where could I go? You're the only love I've ever known. But I hate you. I really hate you so much. I think it must be true love. True love. It must be true love. Nothing else can break my heart like true love, true love, it must be true love, and no one else can break my heart like you.